this is Artifacts of Mars. And in Clay, France, uh, the government was trying to uh, take down a migrant camp, meaning Muslims. And the solution for the Muslims was, well, we'll burn it down. Well, says one woman threatened to cut her wrist in protest from being barred from the site. Migrants have started to torch the notorious jungle camp in Clay over, in protest over the demolition of the site, leading to clashes between angry protesters and the police. So, you don't like it being demolished, but you'll burn it down? What on earth? It kind of reminds me of Ferguson. As flames tore through white timbers and canvas of the building, some migrants called on demolition to stop, with one woman protesting on the roof of the buildings. She warned police not to approach when they moved to arrest her male companion as about 100 makeshift homes in the so-called jungle were torn to the ground with bulldozers likely to continue to work all this week. And we'll scroll down and see the pictures. This has been apparently an ongoing story in Clay. I do have another link to show you on this. I haven't even looked at. And basically, they're running down their own place because in a fit of rage, now well, if they're going to clear it anyway, we'll just burn it down and protest. That makes a whole lot of sense. So stay where he came from. French riot police tried to clear the jungle camp as residents began burning down some of the remaining buildings. I don't know what You know, it's going to become a this one. It's not going to be good. I've heard that some of them are uh, going back from Germany because they don't like it. Which is fine. This is more of a picture essay than anything else. Interesting how they uh, managed to get all this uh, Western clothing. I mean, they're all prepared for the cold. Well, let's take a look at the other site. This one's a little less picture dependent. Uh, French authorities believe about a thousand migrants will be affected by the eviction plan, while aid agencies say the number of people living there is much higher. As you can see, most of them are uh, Middle Eastern men of military age. Those living in camp mainly from the Middle East, Afghanistan, and Africa, across the channel of the UK, often using people traffickers to try to enter illegally. National paper the Figaro as a feature on migrants. We're so fed up with life in the jungle that they want to go home. We're treated like animals. We're slowly dying, Afghan Nazrat says. In Germany, the papers focus on Monday's continuous storming of 
of the Greek Macedonian border and continued debate over Chancellor Angela Merkel's excuse me, Angela Merkel's liberal migration policy. I'm an American. Europe's pain threshold says headline developed using a word that also translates as borders of pain. So there you have it. I think the walls are starting to come down here. That's what it looks to me. I think the walls are starting to come down. You know, just maybe we'll start getting them repatriated where they came from. That would benefit everybody because you just have these differences and you're not going to be able to do away with any of the differences between peoples. It's just not going to happen. It's just the way it is. A lot of people, you know, say we're all one species. Well, yeah, we're all one species, but you can't do away with all the differences between peoples. It just won't happen. I'm Artifacts Mars. Thanks for watching.